Hey there, my name is Gaurav Madan and welcome to this video. Welcome to Interactive Video Suit. You have taken a wise decision by investing in this product and I'm going to walk you through how you can set this up quickly for your first interactive video campaign. To begin with, just navigate to the login screen which would be provided via, your, via the email and via the email and just let's log in it's very simple to log in uh, once you've logged in this is going to be the basic dashboard which you are projected presented with so uh, very first thing which you have to do is you have to go ahead and uh, create a new project that's the number one thing which you have to do you have to create a new project so all you have to do is if just go here and give a project name uh, let's say this is a project for I'm gonna say an example uh, let's say videos review all right and I'm gonna just say go ahead and say create so as soon as we do that our project is created and uh, we could go ahead and go into edit part of it now once you are right here into the edit part that's the project edit settings you would be showcased let's wait for a while all right, so we are here now into the uh, project settings part. And now as you can see, the entire dashboard is divided into three parts. One is you could add the video, then you could set up an interaction layer, and then uh, you could go ahead and you could choose the elements you want to add to your videos. All right, so this is uh, what is there right now. So you, you could add the video either via YouTube. All right, you could take a URL and you could do that or you could add a video with the help of an mp4 video file all right so both the things are possible uh, which you can go ahead and do so if you want to do you can even upload the file if you want all right so here we go so let's uh, you know one, one could go ahead and go ahead, uh, add the videos right here so other than that we have certain settings right here which is project settings you could give the project name you could make it auto play you could have a project font if you want make it a responsive project and uh, serve over http or https all right and uh, you know you could go ahead and also have a project thumbnail if you're not doing an autoplay then you could have a project thumbnail so uh, that's what you have like the basic settings the basic dashboard and next video i'm going to walk you through over how you're going to go ahead and upload your videos and then create interaction layers all right, so I will catch you in the next one.